I really, 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 really love, um, I guess my favorite is Van Gogh. I love Picasso too. It's It's got to be between those two. I mean, if there was a, a mesh of those two, that would be it. I love the texture and the bravery of, uh, not Picasso, of Van Gogh. And I love the drive of Picasso. And I love his attitude. I love that he says every artist, or, or every child is an artist. And you just got to keep them that as they grow up. Because people get squashed in their creativity. And it's usually at a young age. And that's why I love teaching elementary, because that is such an important age. When you talk to people who want to come back to painting as adults, some of my students, they were like, well, I was always told I was no good, you know? And that, that's terrible. <laughs> Because uh, your art is your expression, and there are no rules, and there are no limits, and there should be no that's terrible or that's brilliant. It's just, it is what it is. And I can't believe that people would, I get angry when people say, I can't do it, or I'm not a good artist. I'm like, everyone's an artist. You just choose to do it, or you choose to not do it. Mike says he's not an artist, but you know what? He's a musician, and that's art too. But he's created some things that were pretty fun and amazing, but he just, you know, it's not his thing. If it's not your thing, it's not your thing. But you have to have a creative outlet, whether it's painting or drawing or doodling or, you know, music or anything. Dancing, my God, it's expression. And we were born to do it. We are creative beings. That's our thing. I forgot what the question was.